it's Addie, and today we are starting The Last of Us. This show wasn't really on my radar, but my partner Jeremy watched the first episode last night and he basically said, stop what you're doing, you have to watch this show. I mean, that's not exactly what he said, kind of a dramatic version of what he said, but he really wanted me to check out this show. Only the first episode is out as of now. I know it's based on a video game, but I haven't played it, so I really don't know what I'm getting myself into with this show. The only ideas that I have of it is post-apocalyptic? Zombies? Question mark? So I really don't know what I'm getting into uh, with this show. I don't know how scary it is, how intense it is. So honestly a little nervous because I don't do, I don't think it's horror, but I just don't do scary elements super well. So I'm very interested to see just what this show is like and to just dive in. This is The Last of Us. But most probably something similar to influenza. Because of air travel. Through the year, we end up with a global pandemic. Pan meaning all, the whole world becomes sick all at once. Mankind has been at war with the virus from the start, but in the end, we always win. Not bacteria, not viruses, so... Fungus, because there are some fungi who seek not to kill, but to control. The fungus needs food to live, so it begins to devour its host from within. It keeps its puppet alive by preventing decomposition. Fungal infection of this kind is real, but not in humans. But what if that were to change? What if the world were to get slightly warmer, borrowing into our brains and taking mm -hmm. control, not of millions of us, but billions of us? And I imagine that's what's going to happen. So if that happens, we lose. Oh yeah, that's absolutely going to happen. Ah, some time has passed. Let's see, let's see where the world's at. Um, where's the pancake mix? Gonna make you birthday pancakes. You know, I don't really like pancakes. I know you don't like them. Is this the thought that counts? Come get your uh, homework done. Fractions. <laughs> How old are you again? 36. You're gonna have to wear diapers soon. He says I don't already. <laughs> Still alive, you old f***er. Aw, he loves you. He's dependent on me. Not the same. It's definitely the same. I thought we was having pancakes. You could work a double. I'll bring back a cake. Mm -hmm. I promise. You better bring back that cake. Something bad's gonna happen today and he's not gonna bring her her cake. Your t-shirt's inside out. Uh, Connie was asking after you. I could come by after school, but just for like a little bit. Uh, she'll take what you got. We gotta run, but Sarah will be by later. She'll stay as long as you want. Mm -hmm. Tell you all about She's Atkins. Love that. Great. Tell you how exciting it was to listen to that conversation. Put that out. Verb and noun. Okay, the sentence is where are you going? Twenty. That's it? Okay, thirty. Twenty's good. Something's happening. SWAT team, another thing? We're done for today. It's 3.15, we close at 7. He cannot finish. I'm already finished. Okay, at least home. it's fixed. Ooh, today's a big day. There you are, sweetie. Sorry. Hi, Mercy. Aww. It's a lot of police and stuff on the road today. People out there need to get right with Jesus. I was thinking we'd make some cookies. Chocolate chip? Raisin. <laughs> Her favorite. <laughs> oh, this is creepy. Gosh, I don't know what's about to go down. You know what? My dad's gonna be back real soon. I should go. You sure? Yeah, you, you probably should. And she's bringing him? Oh, the dog knows something is up. I don't know how it spread, so maybe don't eat the cookies. You're 
locked the door for once. Good job. Probably for the best today. Where's the cake? Shit. Yeah, he didn't bring the cake. You don't get your present. You got me a present? Swear. All my life. He fixed the watch. Fixed it for you. Did you? What? I don't hear anything. <laughs> Where'd you get the money for this? Drugs. I sell hardcore drugs. It's better when I do. Besides, it's the thought that counts. And you were never yeah. gonna do it for yourself, so. Thank you. Bard from the Adlers. Oh, this is the one with the deleted scenes. Yeah. Don't fall asleep. Of course I won't. It's too riveting. <laughs> yeah? You gotta bail me out. Now? It's Friday, you don't get me out tonight. I'm in here all weekend. Oh, that sucks. Idiot. <laughs> Oh, I'm a little nervous. Dad? Emergency services are in the area and will be in contact with further instructions. <gasps> oh, easy. Easy, Mercy. Yeah, I really wish uh, he was home right now. Oh, this Mercy, poor please. dog does not want to come here. Mercy! Let Mercy go home with you. Unless Mercy's a zombie. Then maybe not. Oh, you should not go in this house. Oh my gosh. Mrs. Adler? Mm -mm. Oh my gosh, I'm not ready for this. I, I'm not ready for whatever I'm about to see. Mrs. Adler? Oh no. Oh no. <gasps> no. Mm -mm. You have to get out. <laughs> That's why the poor dog wanted to run away. Get the truck! Right now! Right now. Come on. <laughs> At least he knows that something is going on. Oh my gosh. Oh. It's not just the Adlers. We're gonna be brave, and we're gonna get out of this. What? Can we take the dog with us, please? Get your seatbelt oh. on. Hold on. Daddy. We don't know. They're saying it's a virus, some kind of parasite. Are we sick? No, of course not. How do you know we're not sick? They're saying it's mostly people in the city. Hey, Keep driving. We can put them in the no, back. No, 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 no. Oh, that sucks, but you can't really trust anyone. We cut across and we pick up on the, on the west side. Yeah, 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 west, west, all right. All right, hang on. I am on edge right now. Shit. Fucking army. We pick up the highway on the other side of the blockade, then we're out. I imagine this is going to spread over the world very quickly. Nowhere is safe. Oh, so many of them are about to be infected. Dad? Oh. Oh my gosh. I guess planes are going down because people are infected on the planes. Wow. Yeah. Don't look. Uh, you look at me. Are you okay? Are you okay? No. My ankle. Oh, and she's not even able to run. Shit. Oh my gosh. Head of the river, I'll find a way. Get her out of here, Joe. Go. No, Get your eyes on me. Run. Okay? Yeah, you don't look anywhere else. <laughs> Oh, he is very much fine. No, no. Oh yeah, they can move so quickly. Oh, and nothing will stop him. Well, that might stop him. My daughter's hurt, her ankle. Stop right there. We're not sick. I got two civilians by the river. Sorry, repeat. 
Hey, no one told you to move. Okay, understood. Yes, sir. What is... No, no! We are not safe! I'm sorry. Please, stop. His daughter okay? I don't think his daughter's okay. Okay. You're okay. You're okay. Move your hand, baby. I know, I know, I know, I know, baby. I know, I know. I know this hurts. Baby, baby, listen to me. I gotta get you up, okay? I gotta get you up. Dummy, help me! Joe. Come on. Come on. Oh, that's so not fair. Jeez, I didn't expect to wear my tissues. I didn't expect to need tissues in the first episode. Jeez. 20 years later. Oh my god. So now he's been living in this world for 20 years. Is this a real child or is this a zombie child? Wow. Wow, so much has changed in 20 years. We don't want you falling out of the chair. How did you get this? You're safe. So there is a vaccine for it, or, or not. Can't. I, I, I imagine that's just their way of life now, but that's, oh, that's so hard. You got anything else? Late crew, 4 p.m. start. Unauthorized exit from the quarantine zone. You're short five. That'll work. Oxy? Hydro. Mm. For real, it's from Atlanta. I just got a factory down there in the QZ. You want them or not? Hey, do yourself a favor. Stay off the streets for the next few nights. Stay safe. You yeah, you too. What do you want me to say, Tess? It's not like I planned on ripping you off. You gonna keep me here? Kill me? I want you to forget this ever happened. It's just a truck battery. You guys fucked you up. Yeah, so discipline them. What about your guy? He won't hurt you. I'll tell him that I got jumped by some guys. And I'd like to go home and drink till my face stops hurting. So are we good? Yeah. Oh! oh my gosh. Oh, I did not expect that. Oh. Oh, oh my gosh. how I count to ten, too. Hey, people are gonna come looking for me. Let me out or you're gonna pay, motherfuckers! Nothing? If Tommy responded, we'd know. And you're talking to the mm -hmm. tower? Every day. It's never taken him more than a day to respond. That, yeah, it's kind of a long time. I'm sure he's okay. Show me where the tower is. Oh, he's going to go after J him. Joel, it's in Wyoming. There are raiders. There are slavers. But you're sure Tommy's okay? Q bar four, but I don't know exactly what.
jumped by a couple guys. The guys who jumped me were with Robert. He sold on battery to someone else. I need the battery, Tess. Who'd he sell it to? Don't know. Well, where is he? Don't know. Yet. I gotta get this battery. I would very much like for you to hurt him. Okay. We're a pretty intimidating team. The team in place is Southeast 3? I held him back. And why do you have some random girl locked in a room? And the guys you have guarding her won't tell me shit. You two, go to Southeast 3, now. Every Firefly in Boston is gonna gather in this building, and you're gonna leave the QZ. We're taking that random girl locked in that room west. Is this real? I believe it is. We'll get her where she needs to go. Hey, friend. If you're feeling lost... You tell me to look for the light, and I'll break your jaw. Right. Corner of Stillman and Cross. Get into the building from below and take Robert by surprise. Pay this f her back. I'm gonna get this battery. Oh. I don't think that's gonna work. Oh, her. You're not scared. I'm worried that she might try to stab you. Where are you gonna go? Back to Federal Military School? They put me there when I was a baby. I did. Ellie. Oh. My fucking mom or something? Look like your mom? No, you're not. <laughs> Why would a terrorist dump me with Fedra? Was Riley a terrorist? Who's Riley? We're leaving tonight, and we're taking you with us. What I'm about to tell you cannot be repeated to anyone, because if you do, you will die. Zombies down here. Oh! oh, we have to get out of here. I know. I, just, body. I wasn't oh expecting it. Figured he wasn't down here last time. Well, maybe down here is where he was infected. Yeah, we have to get out of here. Yikes. So that's eventually what you turn into? Probably in the 80s. Everyone was cutting down on apartment sizes to sell more condos. This opens into the hallway. It's not opening. Oh. oh my gosh. So many bodies. Well, the battery's no good. He still tried to sell it. <laughs> And he obviously didn't take for an answer. Give me my knife. What do you need a car battery for? Go. Not at her. <laughs> and to answer your question, I need it for a better reason than you do. No offense, but Tommy's just one man. You turned my own brother against me. Okay, Joel. Mm -hmm. That was a lot of gunfire. Fedra was going to be on the way. We were going to move Ellie out of the zone tonight. You're going to do it. The hell I'm not we going are. with them. Let me take her. <laughs> we don't have time for this. Do it. Kim, you don't have a in here on your head, could you please? Okay. And I know what you're both capable of. What are they capable of? You get her there safely. I think you want to know. We'll give you what you need. <laughs> the second we hand that kid over. Y'all talk it through, but please remember that I'm bleeding out. <laughs> yeah, that's true. But before we hand her over, they give us everything that we want. If not, we kill her. There and then. Oh, deal. Okay. Really? Ah, ah, Fast. What a deal. Give us a minute, all right? What the? <laughs> 60s song, they don't have anything new. 70s, they got new stuff. What's 80s? I don't think you're getting an answer. What are you doing? Killing time. Well, what am I supposed to do? I'm sure you'll figure that out. Your watch is broken. I think he's gonna keep it though. I've never been on the other side of the wall. You guys go out there a lot? I guess. But you know where to go. So we're gonna be okay. So what's the deal with you anyway? You some kind of bigwig's daughter or something? Something like that. 
Yeah, I definitely want to find out more about her. Oh, the radio came on when you were sleeping. What? Wake me up before you go-go. <laughs> gotcha. Listen. You got a jacket in your pack? Yeah. Okay, get it. It's time to go. To fight the infection and insurrection. How are you even supposed to get out? Holy sh! I'm actually she outside. Maybe this is crazy. Oh, keep your voice down. You stay close, and you follow my lead. Yeah, yeah, of course. Maybe stay quiet too. You're gonna be shitting me. <laughs> okay, we know you. We know you. You let us do this run, we'll split the cards with you. Oh, were you? Yeah. Really, man? Yep. We're doing this by the book. And half she off on all of the pills. Half off? We can fix this. Move. Oh, he's gone through this exact thing before. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, we gotta move. We gotta move, Joe. But she is sick. She, she, ah. Uh... This is potentially very risky. <sighs> Whoa. Wow. Probably means trouble. Um. Oh my gosh. I didn't know what I was getting myself into, which is probably good because I mean, I have no expectations. I don't know what, I literally don't know what's supposed to happen, but that's just the first episode. I mean, it's so good and it's so well done and it's shot beautifully, but wow, if that's just the first episode, this show is about to be very intense. Hmm, wow. Yeah, I was not prepared, but it's so good. And I'm very curious to see what happens next, like throughout this season. Yeah, I I imagine that you all know more of what's supposed to happen, especially if you played the game. But I literally have no idea what could possibly happen. Like even at the beginning, I literally didn't know that I would need tears for this first episode. And I just... Oh. The whole scene with his daughter, that was so hard to watch. And the fact that she literally just died in his arms, that that's so heartbreaking. And of course he's still haunted by it. I think he's going to be haunted by that the rest of his life. And I imagine that him having to protect this new character, this girl, Veronica was her name before, Ellie? Ellie, I think is her name. I, I mean, I imagine that he's going to protect her like his daughter. It's a very similar situation. Um, also, the fact that she may or may not be infected. I'm curious how that's going to play out. And ah, I'm, I'm into this. I, I was very nervous and just kind of on edge the whole episode because, again, I don't really know the tone. I don't know what's supposed to happen. I don't know the scare level, how scary it is, but I'm into it. I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued with this story. I know, again, I know it's based on a video game, but I don't know much else. So far, it's so well done and I am intrigued. Well, that was the first episode of The Last of Us. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe and we will see you next time.